and gents, if there are any gents that watch me. So, anyways, I stopped recording for a while because I realized that my camera sucks. Um, because I, I use my Mac, and a lot of these, like, gurus and stuff, they use their wonderful cameras that record beautifully, but... I don't have the money. So I decided that shouldn't stop me from recording. So here I am. I'm back. <laughs> and I'm going to start recording it, hopefully. Um, honestly, that's been a lot of the reasons why I don't post anything is because my camera sucks. <laughs> so hopefully you like this video and you guys don't mind my camera sucking so much. A mini update is it's... It's May, um, it's Sunday, it's my wash day, um, in case you don't, can't notice, my hair is still wet from the wash and condition and stuff, and, um, what else? In the last week, I've gotten highlights. Um, don't freak out, um, I haven't noticed any heat, uh, damage from the highlights, so that's pretty good. Um, but, like, I did treat my hair very carefully with the, um, with like conditioners, oils, like I've been like overloading my hair on like Moroccan oil, coconut oil, our, uh, olive oil, um, I've been taking biotin, <laughs> excuse me, I've been taking biotin religiously, like I have really, uh, like I'm trying to take care of my hair because I don't want to see any like damage from the treatment, but um, in case you can't see it, um, that's like the highlights. Um, oh, and in case you're wondering why I'm sitting on the floor in my house, is because this is where I get really good light, and I'm trying to, like, get better lighting when I'm doing my videos, so, um, excuse me, <laughs> my wretchedness. After I got my highlights, my hair has been flat ironed, so it, I mean, well, it wasn't flat ironed, it was blown out straight by, um, you know how Dominicans use the high heat blowout, so I said, uh, one time and um I flat ironed it even straighter because after I leave the salon my hair just poofs up again so I flat ironed it even straighter um I put heat protectant on it and did that and um I kind of had it straight for like a whole week and I didn't really use the flat iron that much again um maybe like a touch up here and there but really I didn't use it again um so I was happy about that when she first did my highlights they looked really bad like horrible until she put like a red rinse right on top of it right after so it's not a rinse is it a rinse on um, when it stays on permanently I don't know these terms um but she put a red tint on top of it and I'm glad she did that because it evened out all my highlights and I like the color better than what it was when she first did it because when she first did it and showed it to me I was like <laughs> oh I almost passed out, like, seriously, because I was like, no, 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 this is not happening, but, um, <laughs> she fixed it, because now it's looking good, girls, so after she did that, I went on the spree of finding what products I was now going to use on my hair, because I basically, I have exhausted all of my products, maybe it's time to switch it up, um, I need to get some new products, Telling you, it's like a haul slash what I did with my hair. I watched Summer Kelsey and Sunkiss Elbow's like curly hair regimens, and um, like Summer just put up hers. Like they both put them up pretty recently, but Summer just put up hers, and it was like my curly hair routine. And so go check her out because I like her. She has like amazing hair. It is beautiful, and um, so does Sunkiss Elbow. I love both their hair. So. I love everybody's hair. One product that I think they both use um, often is the Curl Enhancing Smoothie from Shea Moisture, which I have yet to try. So leave me some comments below and tell me how you feel about that Shea Moisture um, Curl Enhancing Smoothie because I've tried the Style Milk and I really actually love the Style mi Milk. And um, if I had it, I would have put it in my hair today, but... Um, I don't have it because I ran out and I went and got some products because my hair is highlighted and I needed to find things that would be healthy for my hair now that it is highlighted. I figure anything that's mostly natural would be color safe for my hair, but I wanted it to say that it was color safe for my hair because I'm pretty like, I'm so technical when it comes to those things. So, um, 
for right now at least um because I just did it I would love for it to be like you know one new thing that I got that I've been wanting for like two years now is the moisture benefits shampoo from Elucence. it looks like this size comparison to my head um I um, think you can get this in like fine salons um in like different hair salons and on Curl Mart because I got it from Curl Mart because I wasn't about to go looking for the salon that it was in like I didn't have time for that and I think you can buy it from the Lucens website I'm not positive but I'll put the Lucens website on in like my description box so you can kind of check out the different products they have but um this got such high ratings on the Curl Mart or Naturally Curly and I was like well let me try it because it says that it's um it says perfect for chemically or color treated hair and I was like and then it said it says increases moisture content of dry hair and I was like bah, bah. like this is what I want okay and then it says detangles and improves hair manageability color friendly um maximum results blah 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 dual purpose and ultra gentle cleansing and conditioning um you only apply a small amount because it's a condensed product which means that it works twice as hard with half the product Ooh. And um, it's supposed to increase the moisture. So it has peach extract, Irish moss, anise seeds, uh, ginseng, and ginkgo to hydrate. It has wheat protein to strengthen and polysaccharides um, to wash away the tangles. And like the first ingredient, um, I think it's like when you read ingredients, the, the first ingredient is like the one that has the most, right? I think so, right? Anyways. The first ingredient was Prunus persica extract, which is the peach extract, and then it had like the anise fruit. So I washed, rinse, repeat, and because my hair, when it's straight, I like there was so much buildup like from this whole week of me just putting oils and oils and you know, so I knew it, I had to cleanse this bad boy to get back to my natural curls. So, um, um, I love the smell of this. It smells so fresh, like peachy. So this was six dollars from Curl Mart, and um, so far I liked it because when I washed it out, my hair didn't feel stripped, and it it was good. Like I mean, for a shampoo, like I'm happy about it. So six dollars at Curl Mart. The thing about Curl Mart is you can spend six dollars on a product, but then you spend six dollars on um, regular shipping, which I can't stand because I'm like sitting here like, come. on on like six dollars on shipping um, no offense to Kromart because I do love Kromart and I go there to look for everything that I need to look for but so then the next thing I got was conditioner I needed a conditioner bad 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 because my Aussie Moist was done so I researched and researched and researched and I finally gave in and got an Aubrey Organics Honeysuckle Rose Moisturizing Conditioner which I've been like really like iffy about getting like I go to Whole Foods and it's in there and I'm like should I get it or should I not should I spend this ten dollars or should I not hmm, 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 hmm. and it's like I weigh my options and I, I mean it gets really good res um results really good um ratings too now for me it's it was between the white camellia conditioner and the honeysuckle rose conditioner um when I started looking at the back and stuff like this one said also recommended for bleached or highlighted hair. So I'm going to read you the back of what it says. It says, all natural ingredients, the sweet smell of success for your hair. Trade those dry, thirsty tresses for vibrant, touchably soft hair with this moisture intensive conditioner, conditioner enriched with restorative herbal emollients, detangles and rehydrates to overcome dryness and brittleness and leaves hair ultra silky and irresistibly fragrant. Also recommended for bleached or highlighted hair. Um, it features organic shea butter and rosa mosqueta oil which deep condition and protect and soften your hair texture and the honeysuckle extract with at which adds a soft floral uh, um soft floral scent i was sitting there like which one should i get which one should i get so because i just highlighted my hair again i went with this one because of the highlight i liked it today we'll see tomorrow like i'll tell you how it feels when my hair is completely dry honestly because it's I can't tell you kind of like when I'm in the shower, like when it's like when I'm, I don't know. It it didn't feel stripped, so and it didn't feel not dry, so it was it was moisturizing. So we'll see. Um, but in case you don't know, Aubrey Organics is like no animal testing. Um, 
a recyclable container. They're vegan. Like, it's organic stuff. And um, I got this in um, Whole Foods for like 10 a little bit over, it was like $10 and some change. So, now I decided that I'm going to buy, okay, so Summer, Kelsey, talked about that she got this conditioner, VO5, um, moisturizing conditioner for detangling. And I was like, and it's like her cheapo, like, detangling conditioner. I was like, you got it. You got a detangling conditioner and a conditioner? Because, like, for me, like, usually what I do is I just put my conditioner in my hair and I detangle. I leave it in for a little bit and then I wash it out. Like, that's what I do. So, but then I was like, I kind of really want to see what that honeysuckle does by itself, like, for itself not me like manipulating and stuff so I decided to get this for 78 cents at Walmart <laughs> and that's a bargain as my cheapo detangling conditioner and might I add this is a really good detangler like slip 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 I was there detangling my hair and I was like this is really good I like it I'm gonna keep it and it smells nice last new thing that I got snoo Cantu. Cantu Shea Butter for Natural Hair Coconut Curling Cream. Um, helps heal dry, damaged hair, provides intense moisture and strength. I haven't gotten a Cantu product in so long, besides the leave-in. And Summer used this product on her hair, and I was like, yes, girl, I'm going to try that too. And it's $5. So I was like, should I go with the... After I bought all those other products already, should I go with the Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie or should I go with this $5, $6 Cantu Curl Cream? And I was like, I'm going to go with the Cantu Curl Cream since I like the leave-in now. So that's what I did. Basically, after I was done putting in all that other stuff, doing all that other stuff, when I got out of the shower, my hair was soaking wet. I don't dry it. I just leave it soaking wet. I put a little bit of the, um, the Cantu Leave-In Conditioner throughout my hair and then I kind of sectioned my hair off and started with the bottom and I started raking this through now what I did when I raked it was I went like this and you know how your hair is separated into parts I took those pieces the big chunks and I just twirled them so that's how you see like I have these like big twirls in the back right here because I took these big chunks and I just twirled them I didn't take a lot, just a little bit, put more at the roots than anything because that's when, uh, like, I have a lot of dry, like, roots up here. Like, this is where my dry hair is. And then, of course, some at the ends. So, we'll see how it turns out when my hair is completely dry. So far, it looks like it's going good. Um, what I'm going to do after that is I'm going to separate those big chunks. Sorry. I'm going to separate those big chunks and kind of twirl them. Just, just put a little bit of, um... Some like a little oil on my hands, um, not a lot, just a little bit on my fingers, and separate them, and to like fluff it out and give me some body. Uh, this that that is that end part is um, Sunkiss Alba's like routine how she like separates and twirls big chunks and then lets it air dry and then after like she air dries it then she um separates it and gets really good defined curls and I love them and I was like. Ooh, girl, I'm going to try your styling. I'm going to try it. So I'm waiting for my hair to dry so I can do that too. But um, I I'm so excited to see if this really like helps me. But just in case you're wondering, it has no mineral oils, sulfates, parabens, silicones, phthalates, <laughs> gluten, paraffin, propylene glycol, PBA, P PBBA, or DEA. So it has none of that. Um, this curling cream will define condition and add manageability to your curls, leaving them soft, shiny, and deeply moisturized. Made with 100% pure shea butter and formulated without chemicals or harsh ingredients. This restores your real, authentic beauty. Embrace your curly, kinky, or wavy hair with Cantu for natural hair. So, that's my hair. Now for beauty. I was trying out this lipstick. If you can't tell, I was trying out this lipstick on my lips. And so far, I'm really liking it. How do you like it? It's very summery, you know? That's what I was looking for. So I got these two lipsticks yesterday as well. Um, they're from Wet n Wild. Wet n Wild, if you didn't know, these one, these lipsticks in like this container are $1.99. And I think they have another one that's like more like ultra moisturizing or something. And that one's like two two dollars. Um, 
on my lips right now, I mixed them. So the orange is even oranger, I guess, right? It's brighter. So I mixed them, but um, it's the orange one is in the color 90, 970 in Purdy Persimmon. And it's so pretty. I love it. Um, and the berry, like this is like a berry color. I got, and it's 956. Oh, sorry. The number is 965. And it's in the color Cherry Picking. And it is pretty too. So I'm excited. Um, I'm going to swatch them for you just so you see the device. But those are the colors. Yeah. So on my lips right now, both of them. And I also got a new blush, but I left it in my room and don't feel like going to get it. So, <laughs> um, it's Milani. It was like $8 and something cents. And I'm so bad at the cents part. But it's it was $8 and something cents. And it was only, and it's called Luminoso. Lumin, Luminoso. It is like a light peach color, but with shimmer. Once my hair is done, I'll take a picture and I'll put still in my editing here and um I'll also post a picture of when I first when I got it done and when it was straight so you can see and just in case um you wanted to know how long my hair has gotten it's re it's has gotten to my bra strap like it's bra strap length now and I'm so excited <laughs> like I'm so excited because I've been growing my hair for so long but it wasn't until I just really started taking care of it that like it's gotten so long like I'm really excited about it. One thing I'm like on my list of to do's is to get the Moroccan oil intensive hydrating mask or repair mask, one of them. Um, I really want to get them because uh, I've heard nothing but good reviews except the price is like $44. Pretty penny for those things. But okay, so I think that's it for this video. Um, it was really nice talking to you guys again and sharing all this with you and I hope you enjoyed watching me be crazy and scatterbrained. Um, I hope you try these products, and um, if you want, if you have any questions, just ask me below, and I'll answer them, of course. And um, leave me any advice on what you think about the products, and any products that you think that I should try or that you've gotten great results with. And also tell me how you feel about the Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie because I still want to try it. So I might end up buying it and then using both, not using both at the same time, but switching between the two because I really liked it. And I'm going to go get the Style Milk again because I love it. It's moisturizing. So um, thank you again for watching. I'll catch you again soon. Trust me, it I won't take that long because I miss recording. It's fun. All right. Bye, guys.